Topic 18, Lesson 2, Addition and Subtraction Patterns and Equations. The essential question is, how can you describe an addition or subtraction rule with numbers and symbols? So we've already learned how to solve equations with variables. This lesson, you're going to learn how to make a rule with the variables to help you find a missing number. Kind of think about almost like skip counting. So here's an example. Let's say you wanted to go play skee ball and you wanted to win tickets and to win 10 tickets you need 20 points. So in order to win 10 tickets you need 20 points. To win 20 tickets you need 30 mm -hmm. points. So how do we solve this? What is the rule that goes along with this? So let's say x is our number of tickets and y will be the number of points needed. So if we have our x, we have 10, we're going to get the 20 points, or we need 20 points to get the 10 tickets. Same thing, 20, we need 30 points. Now what would be the rest of it? How would we fill in the rest of this chart? Well, the next one would be, let's say, we need 30 and that would give us 40 points. And then for our x, 40, this will give us 50. So what's the rule? The rule is y equals x plus 10. And as I showed you at the, at the end there, if we plugged in 40 plus the 10, we're going to get the 50 points. So our rule is y equals x plus 10. No matter what number we plug into x, as long as we add 10 more, we're going to get the number of points needed. So let's try another one. You're going to pause right here and try this on your own. Fill out the chart, fill out this missing number, and come up with the rule. Good luck. Okay, so let's see if you did this right. Anytime you have an x, you get, if we had 12 as our x, we're going to get 8 as our y. And if we had 16 as our x, we get 12 as our y. So what is, what is the pattern? What is the rule that's coming up with this? So from 12 to 8, we're actually going down by minus 4. Same thing, from 16 to 12, we subtract 4. From 20 to 16, we're going to subtract 4. So if we follow that pattern, if we go from 24 and subtract 4, we're going to get 20. So what's our rule? Our rule is y equals x minus 4. That's our rule. And if we plug that in every single time, no matter what the x is, if we follow it, we're going to get our y. So, now try some on your own. Good luck.